Why the hell did a movie like Poor Things sweep us off our feet, leaving us awestruck and pining for more? Well, let's unravel the magic behind this cinematic sensation. At its core, Poor Things brings us a tantalizing tale, filled with unexpected twists and turns that keep us on the edge of our seats. The unique charm of the movie is a breath of fresh air in the cinematic landscape. Now let's talk about the stars that brought this story to life. The enchanting Emma Stone and the versatile Willem Dafoe deliver performances that are nothing short of extraordinary. Not to forget the visionary director, Yorgos Lanthimos, whose deft storytelling and unique perspective shine throughout the film. And the result? An unexpected success story that has captivated audiences worldwide, making Poor Things a household name. So what's the secret ingredient that propelled Poor Things into the limelight? Let's dive deeper. What if we told you that Poor Things is more than just a cinematic masterpiece? Yes, there's a deeper meaning that has contributed significantly to its success. Let's delve into the heart of this movie, shall we? At its core, Poor Things explores themes of identity and humanity, wrapped in an intriguing narrative. The characters, brought to life by the exceptional performances of Emma Stone and Willem Dafoe, grapple with questions of who they are and what it means to be human. And it's this exploration that adds a layer of depth making it more than just a popcorn flick. The movie makes us question our own identities. Are we shaped by our past, or do we have the power to redefine ourselves? It's a thought-provoking journey that resonates with us on a personal level, making us reflect on our own lives, our choices, and our identities. And then there's the exploration of humanity. What does it mean to be human? Is it our emotions, our capacity for love and compassion, or is it our flaws and imperfections? Director Yorgos Lanthimos beautifully encapsulates this complex question, giving us a movie that doesn't just entertain, but also makes us think, question, and feel. Indeed, it's these profound themes that make Poor Things a movie that touches the heart and stimulates the mind all at once. So, how exactly has this deeper meaning helped Poor Things climb the ladder of success? Well, let's delve into that. The thoughtful themes of Poor Things have done more than just entertain, They've kindled fires of conversation and debate. It's like tossing a pebble into a pond. The initial splash is the film. But the ripples? Those are the discussions, the debates, the reflections that this movie has inspired. And those ripples keep expanding, reaching out to more and more viewers, keeping the movie in the spotlight. Now let's talk about reviews and awards. Critics have a knack for sniffing out substance and poor things has substance in spades. The film's thought-provoking narrative has earned it rave reviews, catapulting it into the limelight. And when you're basking in that kind of glow, awards aren't far behind. The accolades have rolled in, further amplifying the film's popularity and commercial success. But perhaps the most significant impact of Poor Things lies in its ability to touch hearts and minds. It's a film that sticks with you, that makes you ponder long after the credits roll. It's a film that has sparked a dialogue a film that has resonated with audiences far and wide. In the end, it's clear that Poor Things is not just a film, but a powerful narrative that has left an indelible mark on cinema and audiences alike.